Dave here. I'm going to show you how to make one of these uh, stoves. More like a little camp stove or bug out location stove. A little stove you can put in your truck, car, truck. Start with one of these giant semi truck air, uh, oil filters. And what you want to do is cut that right around the top of the edge, right there. At the Right where the curve starts. So what you're going to do, you get your sharpie here. And you're going to mark it. Right there, you can just eyeball it right there where it comes right to the edge. Right there, make a mark. And then you want to go down eight inches from there. I'm going to make two lines around the circumference here. Show you how to do that. The easy way. Yeah. What I got here is my it's my radial arm saw. And I'm gonna take my Sharpie here. Mount it to this exhaust of the radio arm here. Now I can raise this, just crank it up and down until I get to the height. Mark. Oops. That don't count. Well, I should have marked three and a half inches up from there. Three and a half inches. More or less. Doesn't have to be precise. Twist it around here. Don't twist it at the top. It'll tip over. You'll hold it at the butt base. Twist. Yeah, looks like it's a pretty good line. Okay, that's the top cut. I'm not going to go down that low. Excuse me. Nice to be able to get the three and a half on here.
Gonna have to rig something different. We're gonna cut the top off first and then I'll be able to turn it better. We'll try that. Okay, the way that I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna take my rotary tool here. Good old rotary tool with the abrasion blade. I'm just gonna do it by hand. I got a good line here to follow. I'm just gonna go right down that line, do it by hand, see what happens. Got a bunch of paper dolls in here. What is this? Huh. Okay. Now I need to mark eight inches up. Here, see if I can get it in my back to the radial arm saw. Just gonna show you the the cut that's on there. Let me get the the other piece. It's gonna fit right inside there. Oh yeah, it, it, it'll go. Look at that. The watch is on a lot of sharp edges. Should be wearing gloves. Oh, cut up from last time. <coughs> yeah, I need to mark the final cut here. Just move the radial arm saw in until it touches. Oops, oops. Too much. Still, anyway, sort of got a line on there. Oh, <clears throat> back to the rotary tool. Same process here. Gonna do it by hand.
I got the two. Just a little bit shorter than the other one. Maybe I should do. Let's see. Put this a little bit lower. Turns up to three and a half inches. The line is lower. So now we got to get to the drilling part. Got both the pieces. This piece got a piece that's gonna go inside here. Oops, sorry, dropped you. Piece going to go down inside here. Might have to do some grinding on that to get her in there, but yeah, let me clean up the edges and start grinding. Drilling, I mean. <laughs> yeah, now I'm going to go around and mark where my air vent's going to go. I got a three quarter inch drill and I'm putting them an inch the first row holes one inch from the bottom center and an inch and a half apart. So let me mark those. So that's uh, two and a half. Yeah, I can just probably just eyeball this other row here. Maybe I shouldn't. I can put another row of holes in the center of these. I'm just gonna eyeball them. This is where it's supposed to be. Scientific. Anyway. I gotta make three little holes for the pop rivets here. So about the third of the way. So I'm just gonna eyeball those too. Now we'll get to drilling. Yeah. Let's make some holes.
that's it. Clean off the burrs. I got all the holes drilled. Along here. Three quarter inch holes, a bunch of them. About an inch and a half apart. And I got the bottom. The screen or whatever it is. Just drilled a bunch of holes there. <clears throat> now, you gotta get some in here. Eight inch pop rivets. Already drilled these holes along this line here for the stops. And I made those eight inch holes earlier. I'm just gonna put these pop rivets in there. That'll be done. in here. Concave that way. Sits right in there. Let's go get some sticks. Try it. Go camping and you don't want to build a fire. You know, uh, campfire. Stay low profile with the these filter filter stoves. It's the heat up here, it's starting to melt off the paint.
next will be the uh, grill.